okusinzira kusemateka we gwanga mu teka lya leadership code liragira abakulembeze bonna okwanje ebyobugagga byabwe mu kawairo namba asatu muemu omkubiriza wa parliament ya Uganda Anita Netamong ayanju debibye eri kalisoliso wa government be in compliance with the section 41 of the leadership code act i will declare my incomes my assets and my liabilities speaker asinzi de wano na sababu kulembeze na bakozi ba government okulaba anga banja ebyobugagga byabwe bebalina okusobola okutukiriza amateeka chegalagira part 17 of the leadership code act 202 it requires ig and its deputies to declare assets liabilities incomes to the speaker of parliament we are gathered here to fulfill the requirement of the law in furtherance to accountability and transparency i thank you for complying the constitutional obligation by ensuring that you come here and we perform what we are supposed to do as parliament and you as ig who our staff anyway. <laughs> Ona zanti okwanje byobugagga kiyamba okumanya byolina naba kubanja eranga chikola kirunji nyo. As parliament and you as IG who are our staff anyway. <laughs> it's a very crucial thing that we must always be accountable to the people who gave us these jobs and we must be transparent. I, I don't see why should, people should continue hiding whatever they have in other people's name. If I have a property which is in my name, it is mine. And if I can account for where it came from, I should be able to do that. The quest of accountability is very, very important in good governance. If we can be able to make sure that we make everybody accountable for what he or she has, we will be reducing corruption in the country. I so uh, we appreciate really what you go through. Alazenga Parliament wegendo okuyamba mukuwagira embalirira yechitongo lechino echa IGG basobola okukola emirimu jabwe obulungi. You are holding everybody accountable for whatever they have and whatever they 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 get from wherever. I want to reiterate our commitment as Parliament of Uganda that we will always support you and we believe in the rule of law and constitutionalism. We will support you in whatever you are doing as IG in terms of your budgets. We know you are constrained with the staff. Now you are going into declaration. In the declaration you will go down up to the local level. But because you don't have enough staff, you don't have money to recruit staff, you find that you may end up getting backlog. But as Parliament, as we go into the budgeting process, we want to make a commitment that will ensure that you work well and will facilitate you financially. Amyoka kaliso liso wa government, Dr. Patricia Achan, asanyu kide chuko rachino, ilana ena sababa antu, okujumbilo kuwa yo, ebi obugagabi abwe. Because to declare, the leaders are expected to declare to the IGG. We are here today because the law requires us to declare to the Speaker of Parliament. So all the other leaders are supposed to declare to the IGG, and it is online. They are supposed to log on to the system and submit this declaration to the Inspectorate of Government. Yes, thank you very much. Patricia Gamba, Bamazo Kulo Paba Kozba Government Mukoti, Abawe Lila Dalana Mbatano, Abaga no Kwanjula Ebyo Gagabi Abwe. Omumbeja Grace Nasolo, Delta TV, Amasukulum.